ongoing situation with the BBC and Gary Lineker. Oh, don't, 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 don't. What do I feel about it? Right, here we go. What do I feel about that? I think I have never heard such a disgusting comparison as to the British government and his, his, like, his analogy that it's similar to Germany in the 1930s, which was Nazi Germany, okay? We as a nation, what we hasn't done, first of all, he hasn't come out and criticised the traffickers, the people who are trafficking, trafficking these people, who are making millions and millions out of poor people, some people who are genuine asylum seekers or genuine uh, refugees, and some who are obviously jumping on their boats and coming over here, are coming from countries that don't even have any war going on in them and just taking advantage of it. He's not... So that, that is an illegal activity. So how on earth can you compare us as a nation with them, Gary Lineker? How can you compare us from that point of view? It's just disgraceful. It's de demeaning. And the BBC are just a bunch of pussies who just rolled over and allowed that to happen. And it's disgusting. You know, people who are paying licence fees are allowing it. He's entitled to his views, but they're ill-informed views. It's an ill-informed comparison. You know, he's, he's smart about everything. I mean, I know he's the guy who, who um, when he was young, suffered a lot of racial abuse because he was black, or that people thought he was black. What is that all about, by the way? But that's what they thought about him. This is the fella who went to Qatar, where they built the stadiums in Qatar and had all the problems as, as people, highly publicised problems about human rights. And he went there and took, took, the, took, the, took, the, took the money for the World Cup and went out there and presented. So please, don't. we don't need you to present. Pre to, to preach to us, the, the, the public, you've got a platform. And that platform, I don't know whether you're an employee or whether you're a freelancer, that's still to be determined, I think I understand. But whatever you are, at the end of the day, get your facts right. We're not Nazi Germany, we're Britain. And in Britain, we are good people. And in Britain, whether you like it or not, the, the, the refugees, illegal refugees that are here, are being looked after. They're not being gassed. They're not being worked to death. Fuck him.